my dolls welcome to my birth vlog today is the 21st of june and it's a wednesday and the time is 15:29. and yeah today is the day i get to meet my princess actually not today i'm probably gonna meet her tomorrow but yeah so we are getting ready to go to the hospital we have to be there at six o'clock so um i was just finishing up a few things finishing up packing a few of my things like my toiletries and everything that i was using and yes ready i'm very excited and a bit nervous i don't know what to expect but get one thing I know is that my body was made for this. Um, so it shouldn't be that difficult for me to give birth and welcome my baby into this world. I've prayed and I've put everything into God's hands. I know he will be with me and everything will go smoothly. I am really excited. Um, it's very cold it looks like it's gonna rain actually um, but yeah rain is blessings so I wouldn't actually mind that so yeah we're first actually gonna start at the office I forgot some of my files there that I need for the hospital so we're gonna start there and then after that we just need to go to discam and get a few things and a few snacks um, because we actually have, we can pack some snacks, so we'll just get a few snacks and just a few things. It's been like as tang and then so it's not just tang up and up, but it's like literally a few things like if I was lean and doing job. And yeah, and then we are going to head to the hospital. Nice thing about the hospital, it's like what 15 minutes away from where we live, so it's not far. It's so um, it's not like Basel is permanently lean. So yeah, so I thought let me just start this vlog here, introduce it, and I hope this I cope. I'm really hoping that I cope, but okay, we shall see if um this is was because basically Kwan is the one that has to vlog. I don't know how much pain I'm gonna be in. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to check in with you guys every now and then just to update you about what's happening. So um it's actually gonna be his responsibility. So if you have a vlog, you guys but when the guy looked at the panda, if not, then he didn't. Um, he's very excited and nervous. And yeah, let's do this. Let's do this. Let's do this. So the funny thing is, a panda will probably be born tomorrow. And tomorrow is my niece's birthday, Onilise, the 22nd of June. So it's it's just it's amazing i don't know yen's again journey but yeah it's great when i realized i was like so excited and happy but yeah i can so they're gonna share birthday they're gonna be so close like sending a picture of us over twins basically because but she's um so yeah um i'm running out of breath i'm i'm running out of breath again as always uh, that man, we're not gonna go through this again and um yeah guys i am sure i'll see you guys when we at the hospital and yeah No, but I am nervous for you. But yeah, okay, yeah. Such a good one.
Hey guys, just a mini update. So we are finally here. We got here around six o'clock. Let's figure on six nip but like ten to six. Um and then for we, once we were early. For once we were early I saw the squad's belly to film because I was running a little sun. Um so um we checked in. Is it called checking in go plans a couple? We got admitted, yes. So we got admitted and then Safi like in all the paperwork and then we were told to come to our room. Let's go um, go go. I don't know if I told you guys a colour when I updated you guys, but um, I'm actually getting induced. Um because I was actually supposed to give birth on the 29th, which is next week. But um who that like a panda has to go away and he wanted to spend like nobody vacay with a panda before he goes away so that's why our doctor was like no 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 it's fine we can just um induce you a few days before like the actual day lobos was along I kind of thing so that's why we decided to do it today so um we got here I got changed and then um but a sample of my urine just to see if everything is fine and then if I got Ella Banti to monitor the baby's heartbeat um and everything so now the last thing that the doctor did with the bezon checker was to ufaka um something down there so it's um what helps you with the induction obviously um so that's what happened so yeah i'll update you guys again later on hi actually i thought you never goes on but no so um bendy can also that helps with the induction um i haven't felt anything but it's been like 30 minutes to an hour if i do so yeah so apparently after a few hours but i'm still fine support what the hell um so yeah that's what's happening i'm excited and nervous guys yo, the when the doctor was inserting what if uh, what is it called i don't know what it's called but the pain the pain guys yo i think from zero to ten i'd say it's eleven diana bila real quick it was so painful but yeah okay, at least it's quick so yeah i could escape what you want to and then yeah but it was really painful and then go apparently they're gonna come back um to see how far dilated i am so that's the only part in the stress <laughs> but other than that shame everything is fine i'm hungry though i don't know if you're supposed to eat i don't know if this if this is or yeah um yeah i'll keep you guys updated as back when i can do the time is one it's half past eight so we've been here since six o'clock so yeah i'll keep you guys updated as go back when days and guy but for now not a little update i think the last time i spoke to them that was before you 
So, Make sense ka nang kanan. Ngo ben sala pa mo. Kasi mo the thing lindi ka ko ako pants. Mm. Yeah. So after that I didn't really get much contractions. Um I didn't get much contractions and like I can feel one coming. Um and then um after that it was really difficult to lala. I didn't sleep much. I think I slept for like three hours. Um and the other thing I like to see is that the nurses keep on coming in by book check uh or buzzing the group ears or something, so you don't really get much sleep. Um so this morning around five o'clock it was actually five to five after I showered. Probably now was a half past four to go take a shower. My contractions were still not bad. Um busy busy cool and busy mild is what I would say. And then um so I went to go take a shower and I get her ready. On my way out to the toilet, my water broke. I actually thought he was coming and I'm like, what the hell is happening? But yeah, my water broke. And then from then on, I was moved um, to this. I think this is the labor ward or labor room. Delivery room. Delivery room. I don't know if it's the same. Yeah, something like that. Because obviously, girl, my water broke. So um, you can take policy. And the contractions are just crazy. You're they're crazy. And I just got a drop. Was it because I was on your own? So I have a bad couldn't find my veins. So if I go up again, it's so painful. The color in my life of a man it drop. Okay, it was the first time for everything. So yeah, so that's what's happening currently. I am one centimeter dilated. Imagine it's been a whole eight hours, I think, and I'm only one centimeter dilated, and I need to get to a ten in order to give birth. Yeah. So as I was saying, um, one centimeter is dilated, and go go. Um, we are about to have breakfast. I'm actually really hungry. I'm looking forward to having breakfast. Then after that, um, they're gonna start me on something called oxy. Is it oxytocin? Oxytocin. Oxytocin, which is gonna um. So as I was saying, I am one centimeter dilated currently, and we're about to have breakfast, which I am looking forward to. I am so hungry. The last time I ate, I think was this Zolo. Um, baby, when you bought me McDonald's. I think his supper was basically severe when we got here. So um, instead of having a sandwich, because they said they could quickly fix me a sandwich, um, Okwana just got me McDonald's. Um, so we're gonna have breakfast, and then after I've had breakfast, they're gonna start me on something called the oxytocin, um, which is also supposed to by E and the contractions is the way C. And as I get more contractions, obviously my um, is it cervix area softens and it becomes bigger and yeah i'm gonna be more dilated afterwards and then i i think she said um when they start me on your oxytocin they're also gonna um also put me um on the epidural so that i don't feel the pain and yeah and i was telling her and as was a bunch and you can send back with the oxytocin I feel like with epidural, it's not going to be as painful. So yeah, just wanted to update you guys. That's where we are at currently. Yeah. Oh, I'm getting contraction. Yeah, it looks like it's a big one.
food. Ooh, so we've got eggs, sausage and tomato. We've got muesli and yogurt. Ah, so that's the one car. I didn't even ask for bread, so my name's a new favorite oh. actually. And then this is my tea. This part I lose a first word. You put in Nobis. Nobis. Of what? Got another contraction. I'm going to let. Did you say little granny or late granny? Little late granny. Oh. Why would I say little granny? That's your short. <laughs> no, yeah, I, I, I'm a little bored. No, my late granny. So I have her with me today. That's a good. That's a good. I'm just. I'm going to continue and I'm going to Cool, no cool, man. I lead at your band. Yeah, band, actually. Oh, that's actually cool. You're going to eat with me. I'm not going to finish with this. Mm -hmm. There you go. Onions. Mm -hmm. Sauce. Yeah, I've been trying to go chili, but. Melon. Not need the sauce. Sweet chili, my name. Oh, I didn't think you meant the sauce. But you move fingers. I'm supposed to make it dozy. And yes, I'm going to need some. I don't have more feeling because I was not in pain. Oh. I feel a bit drowsy. If I'm going to then I think and it might have a similar effect on you. And but the heartbeat is so good. Yeah, I'll be Because I'm going to be in the water. i but mm, like mm, was my yeah. That's good now. What else? I'm not the color of the long. The woman for him, but Kali Lila and Zan. Because it was in her position, it was stable. I can't either end the war. <laughs> and I figure I have a good feeling. I was just like, oh my gosh, what's in the worst time? 
Любим протяжение. И Pour ma Okay, if I just do a sharp scratch now on your back. Okay, sharp scratch on your back now. Done. Well done, baby. Sana, you're wondering a book. So I think, um, since what am I saying? I think I just got my epidural. And the 
say my feeling guys um so i got my epidural like 20 minutes ago then say kick it in then after that um the fakwa e catheter and then the chekwa i'm like five centimeters dilated now so five more to go i can't feel a thing thank the lord guys the contractions were on another level they were on like busy and bearable but yeah yeah i've got, got my patrol and yeah the only thing that i need to do now is um who's that oh panda uh, so yeah i'm so happy i'm very very happy guys yo i said in the the house of whatever my husband was during this whole process oh baby you were amazing it's just that we didn't take videos it's the least i can do that's worth seeing like he was with me through each and every contraction oh my love like seriously you are amazing i'm just so lay if the nurse is not here and something comes out you were really amazing my love it's like baby baby so, but we're time. almost there now mm -hmm. because now i can't feel the pain i feel like the worst part of this whole thing is the pain so i'm numb i can't feel the pain um yeah i just need to give birth and welcome my baby girl into the world i'm so excited and yeah hopefully this is a wise you take out a video when i'm pushing um yeah your responsibility comes to the key guys if it doesn't happen he has been willing to i'll try but that's not gonna be my focus yeah but give you excited to meet our baby girl and yeah the journey is a feature yeah I'm 